Good to see you, Danny. You better have rum. So what's our next move, Espada? You got any ideas? You're not listening! You're not listening! Shut your mouth! We have to hit Jose's tobacco. Head enough out of you, Singal. You just gonna let this happen? <laughs> Long time coming, Danny. <clears throat> Montero Justicia. Stop! Your brother's a traitor. See, si. And he'll spend the rest of his life making up for it. You ready to look in the mirror and admit your mistakes? You first, Camila. Fine. I voted for Castillo. I didn't want to, but Vivido was going to make us rich, wasn't it? Mierda, I doubted you. All of you. I blamed you for not being guerrillas. But Papa was right. To get faith, you gotta give it. If you want to... If you want to say, you have to think big. He don't where it hurts. His tobacco fields. We dried out already. No, all of his fields at once. Draw his soldiers out, leave him open. That's smart. Well, lucky for us, Philly plans ahead. Me and the hero got you covered. Good. We divide our forces. Targeted strikes, checkpoints, guard posts, everything. In and out. And then we hit that airbase hard. Now what the fuck are we still doing here? Dale! Yaranos hasta el final, Roberto. Hasta el final. Hold on to your ass, hero. But I'm about to see my greatest work. Nepal Nino. Metal bird, hellfire, and the hope of the West only one. So you've flown this? No, never. I'm afraid of heights. But I'll be the wind beneath your belly. Moral support while you rip Jose a new one. <laughs> oh, 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 hero, hero. You're gonna need my soundtrack. Philly magic, babe. <laughs> okay, Philly. Let's see what you got. Magic, baby. Fucking Philly. Guerrillas, you ready? I want to hear you. Sanchez, ready. Torres, I'm here. Napalm Nino, all good up here. Serrano, ready. Ortega, let's fucking go. We draw out Jose's forces and leave the airbase open. Then we hit him with everything we got. Let's kick some ass. genius. Boom! Fuck yeah, Philly. How you like that, El Pequeño? Still got more to burn.
Ah, yeah! Almost done now. Oh, hell yes! That takes care of the Viviro. And you're next, Jose. Gotta get to that airfield. Ortega, what's your status? I don't see anybody yet. I think we're clear. We're south of the base, ready to move. We good to start shooting or what? Three o'clock. Open fire. Some come mierdas on the left. Watch your fire. Hold your position. Don't move until I say. Flanking on the north side. They won't know what hit them. Come on, compais. Let's move. Oi! We need help! We're taking fire! Move, move, move! On the right. Don't let them pin you. Shoot those fuckers! Fire now! Anything you got! Shit, we're getting swarmed! We're cut off! I repeat, we're cut off! Stay calm. Stick to the plan. We're getting hammered out here! Where's our backup? Hold it down! Support is on the way! Guerrillas! Give me your studies! Holy shit, Espada! They never saw us coming! All good up here. Starting to believe in that Philly magic. Took some hits, but we're okay! Us too! We should cut El Pequeño down to size! Good work, guerrillas! Search for any gusanos we might have missed. Danny, meet me at the airbase. You and me got a date with Jose. You got it. Espada, you okay? Si, now get your ass over here. On my way. Almost there. Where's our Danny head up? Almost there. Where's our tiny head at? One of our guerrillas said he's putting him in the control tower. Okay. Head in there now. Not here. Coño, you sure? Little Comenier that could be hiding in some tight places. No, he's.
one million if you kill her. <coughs> Two million! Got on cigarettes. Well, you couldn't find these out here. Anton loves me. He'll send this army to rape and murder every one of you fucking Monteros for this. I don't see no Anton. Or your true yard and friends. You know, my papa gave me this blade when I was seven. Told me how to throw it, how to kill with it. <clears throat> you look just like him. Tell me, is there enough of him left to bury? <clears throat> but this blade doesn't really say Yara's might, does it? You took my land. You took my papa. And now it's time to give. No vemos, Napoleon el pequeño. Not like I remember it. Alice gone. Again. That's his choice. And Papa? Did he get a choice? Did he get to see us win something? You never would have won anything if he was still here. How the fuck would the Queen of Libertad know? I know he was never going to give you the farm, Camila. Or the camp. But look what you achieved. His father, you are what the camp needed. You are what Libertad needs. You are the one to help us take down Castillo. She's not wrong, Espada. There's no future for the West without help. And there's no future for Libertad without the West. Monteros don't shake. We drink. To the Montero. To the future. You want to confess? Confess. Why are we here? You never even liked Jose. Why? He was an asshole. Why? He was weak. Me papa had a saying. God gives victory to the lions. Sounds religious. <laughs> Me papa love Jesus. He would always say, Jesus would make an amazing Yale Presidente. Me and Tan always remember. Jesus was both the lion and the lamb. Rule with strength, but understand suffering. You believe that? After he was murdered, your grandmother and I were left to survive alone. She would always remind me of my father's obsession with that verse. She hated it. Why? Because he had it all wrong. Be the lion and the lamb? No. She would say, Anton, there are lions and there are lambs. Rule or be ruled. A Castillo must be a lion. For Yara is full of lambs. You don't talk about her. She was always strong, smart, powerful, but <laughs> a woman in Yara. And in those days, she had the wrong skin to lead. Me, Papa, was a lamb. Jose is a lamb. Hmm. You want to know why we're here? You are a lion. And we eat the fucking lambs.
Nene, the West owes you its freedom. But we need to build momentum or the revolution will fail. Maximus Matanzas and the legends are out there and they need your help. I hear you. Thanks, Clara. Can I do it? President will work. Respond now. This what happened? A bunch of them got pissed up. Smashed into each other on the phone.
Oye, Clara. I'm near El Este. And history is repeating itself. What do you mean? This is the land where legends are born, Danny. The 67 revolution started in El Este. El Tigre, La Quimama, Lorenzo, Lobo, they led the guerrillas who overthrew Castillo's father, Gabriel. Libertad is taking Yara full circle. And they know I'm coming to give them the good news. El Tigre is very, very excited. Promise. El Tigre? That's me. You must be that kid Clara mentioned. Libertad's chosen one. I'm not a kid. Of course not. You're baby Tigre. And don't worry. Ah! Oye, Clara. I'm near El Este. And history is repeating itself. What do you mean? This is the land where legends are born, Danny. The 67 revolution started in El Este. El Tigre, La Quimama, Lorenzo, Lobo, they led the guerrillas who overthrew Castillo's father, Gabriel. Libertad is taking Yara full circle. And they know I'm coming to give them the good news. El Tigre is very, very excited. Promise. El Tigre? That's me. You must be that kid Clara mentioned. Libertad's chosen one. I'm not a kid. Of course not. You're baby Tigre. And don't worry. I'll make sure you don't end up one of Benitez's trophies. Who's Benitez? Head of Castillo's Navy. A real sea monster. She likes to hang traitors like fish for all of El Este to see. Pal carajo. Well, I'm in Aleste now. I love it. <laughs> All of it. You, uh, have a long night? The rum and coke was flowing last night, baby Tigre. Minus the coke. Been there. I'm sending you some photos. Should help you find us. Is that a crab rock? See. Si. Call me when you get there. And bring grappling gear. You're going to need it. Now get moving up our mountain. We can't wait to meet you, baby Tigre. Oye, El Tigre. I'm at the Crab Rock. Very artistic. Lorenzo's the artist, and we guerrillas are like the crabs. Hard shells? Sharp claws? They fight from the jungle to give birth in the ocean. We fought from the ocean and gave birth to La Revolución. Si. I got it. Take the footpath up the mountain. Very easy. A guerrilla must be short-footed, like a goat. Goat? I thought we were like a crab. Hello? The view from the waterfall. What's with you? The view from the waterfall. Looks like the waterfall from El Tigre's photo. Need to get up there. El Tigre, I'm at the waterfall picture. It was taken after a bloody battle. Three days of hiding paid off when a platoon of paratroopers landed right in our kill zone. Planning and patience are guerrillas' best friends. So is a handful of grenades. <laughs> Yeah, I get it. Yeah. Goats. 
fucking show offs. trail for sweaty touristas. They'd visit our camp, leave their shit everywhere, take photographs of us like we were animals in a zoo. So we might have accidentally lit a few dynamite sticks and might have accidentally blocked the trail. Really disappear up here. It would make an army blind. How is the air both thick and thin at the same time? Look out below. the next picture. Let me guess. Garillas are like sharks. Deadly predators with knives as sharp as teeth. Actually, that rock just looked like a shark. Who's the one dangling underneath it? That's Lucky Mama. We never knew when the Sodal would find our camp, so we had to secure fast ways up and even faster ways down. Lucky always volunteered to be the first to test the lines. Brave. I hear you're brave too. Clara told me about you. You know, I also grew up without a mama or papa. And you still became a legend. <laughs> Many Garias are orphans, baby Tigre. But it's not our parents who define us, it's our actions. It's like therapy. El Tigre, Amate Statue. Dear friend, killed in combat when we stormed Esperanza in 67. Yesterday was the anniversary of his death. That explains the hangover. Every year I drink two bottles of rum. One for me, and one for Lobo. You never lived to see a free Yara. To be honest, neither did I. This is the last bit. Felicidades! You're ready? Oh, 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 el tigre! What a Danny! What the hell? You're trapped. Death is staring you in the face. What do you do? <laughs> I've been kicked in the cojones a thousand times. I haven't felt them since 72. Hey. Now we'll do that again. What? Mi casa su casa, baby tigre. Come on! Me the family. Lucky, my nose is broke again. 
I'm not your fucking mother. There are people out there who are actually hurt. I am suffering. I easy, mama. Her piece doesn't count. Meet Lorenzo Canseco, poet of the legends. Well, I sense the hot blood of a fighter. And of course, you know Lucky Mama, heart of the legends. It's not broken. Really? I felt it go crazy. Merda! Another patient? Hmm. Looks like La Morale to me. I'm Danny Rojas from Liberta. The new fist of the revolution. No, Clara sent me. Liberta needs the legends on her side. Heroes to believe it. To fight another Castillo? He's exactly what Yara deserves. Buena suerte. Sorry, one revolution was enough. Looks like Clara was wrong. Have faith, Danny. They just need to get to know you. Come see me when you get settled, my baby Tigre. Okay. Remember the three guerrilla pinsmen? Always be moving. Clara, I've met the legends. El Tigre is the only one on board with Libertad. Do whatever you have to and get them to join this fight. The people need heroes to believe in. I just hope they still want to be heroes. Um, I don't Do I have time for dominoes? I go. Supplies. I'm working on it. Don't put off what you can do today. Because tomorrow can turn into yesterday, and by then it's too late. I think you might need a nasty guy. They have seized this better. This is too easy. Que vola! Who are you? We're La Moral, and the Leste is our land. Our land, our medicine. You practice that little speech. Yeah. This is property of Libertad. Ah, Libertad. Knew you would come begging for our help. We should be fighting Castillo together. I'm Honron, second in command. Three, four. Nice bro. Name's Danny. Danny Rojas. Uh-huh. Company! Over there! By the chopper! Batter up! I 
see them! Libertad, but Yelena needs these supplies. We got wounded. Yelena's your boss. Yeah, she's gonna kick my ass if I don't come back with something. Well, Clara's gonna try to kick mine if I don't bring this to the legends. Libertad wants the legends of 67? Half of Yara thinks they're dead. Oh, they're very alive. And half of La Moral thinks they're full of shit. But I majored in history. They paid him blood to put Anton's papa in his grave. Tell you what, you give me these supplies, I'll introduce you. Ah, coño. Yelena's gonna kill me. But at least I got to meet the legends first. Now, Danny, you get us a chopper? Then we can talk supplies. Welcome to La Moral. Libertad. Whatever. Danny, right? You need a chopper? Well, you won't get any in the sky while they're fucking at the aircraft cannon, is that? Do everyone a favor and destroy it. The next one over finds the military tower along the western coast.
farmers in Fernando municipality has been extremely helpful to Libertad. And now they are getting a lot of pressure from the regime every single day. What can I do? You should talk to Senora Toga and see what she needs. She's the president of the farmers' collectives there. I'm on it. She just told Libertad that her farmers are about to break our agreement. We really need these people on our side, Danny. Easy now. Easy. Those guerrillas need help. Finally, some fun. Danny, what? Looks like a good place to raise a family. Freddy, oh, 
greatest hitter Yara has ever produced. I think they're monitoring the airspace. Better stay grounded here. Air vehicle B five six zero six. Identify yourself immediately. Okay. There's an enemy chopper. They're creeping the skies nearby. Just make sure you're not underneath when I shoot it down. Oye, Clara, I mean Aleste in looking at a pretty fucking tall radio tower. That's Castillo's personal broadcasting tower and spy station. Get in there and download whatever intel you can. Let's find out what Castillo's been listening to.
Can't fly here. Got to find another place to take off. This airspace is restricted. Who's flying that thing? God damn it! Better watch my step. See you, Horon! Repinga! Every soldado in Yara can see you! The supply. <gasps> Falapinga! El Tigre! Feast of the Revolution! You gotta sign my pants. Como se llama, señorita? Honron. Eh. I'm with La Moral. Uh, La Moral? Terroristas. Honron, this is Lore. I know who he is. I think the word he's looking for is guerrilla. You're not guerrillas. You're a street gang. At least we're not hiding on the mountain while the world goes to shit. Have you seen what's going on down there? Go, check out a Biovida facility. I dare you. The legends don't take orders from anarchists. Entiende? Enough, Lorenzo. <gasps> no, you know what? Fuck you. La Moral is keeping these supplies. This is our revolution, not yours. A farmer got caught in the crossfire today. Took a bullet in the stomach. Without this, 
He won't make it to tomorrow. Lucky mama. A lot of the bullets I pull are from La Morale. There is a difference between playing with guns and fighting La Revolution. El Tigre. Okay. They're big on lectures. If these abuelos want to live in their museum, whatever. A quien le importa. Or maybe I borrow some souvenirs. Talk to me when you got a minute. I cannot believe Hon Ron is actually here. She is one of the best baseball players Yara has ever seen. She's wasted talent. Got her you next move. Lose. What do you hope you have good camera skills? What do you get? I'll tell Yelena you're on your way. What's up, Moron? There are some things you need to know about Yelena. She's mad smart, computer science major, programmer. People think she's just a power nerd. But when the shit goes down, she's a fighter. How did a programmer become a guerrilla leader? Guess you didn't see the video. Before there was a La Moral, Admiral Benitez executed our classmates. Bing. They got that on video? No. The next day, soldados stepped to us at the funeral. Yelena led us in the fight. We took out like a hundred soldados. That shit was on video. One hundred soldados. Okay, maybe like fifty. Fifteen. Coño. I gotta go. Just spotted a soldado near your stash with his pants down. Literally. He's pissing and he doesn't see me. <laughs> I'll call you back. Danny, where you at? Getting close, I think. So you know, Helena's the big boss. I'm team captain, and you won't be able to miss Gilberto. Why? Who's Gilberto? Only the most fabulous spy from Yara. You can't even fart in El Este without Gilberto's network hearing about it. Spies and hackers. La Moral sounds like the real deal. Come out. Thanks for the heads up. Coño, I got a helicopter on my ass. Call me when you get there. I'm at Concepcion. How do I find La Moral? I'll send you a pic. Show no one. What are you sending me? It will help you find the door. Don't forget the password and remember. Curfew. <laughs>
muerto el perro, se acabó la rabia. Welcome to el agujero. Try anything and I'll cut your head off and use it as a football. Nice to meet you too. My name's Danny. Alfredo. Down the stairs. Volunteers. I'll talk to my people, honey. Big Jorge and Anna's gangs are probably on the ship. You're Yelena? Mierda! Danny, right? Where's my medicine? You mean Libertas meds? I gave them to the legends. No. You handed it to some retirees shitting their diapers on top of a mountain. What could you possibly want from them? We need more than bullets and guerrillas to Titan Castillo. Like it or not, Yaranos love the legends. Clara Garcia loves her politics. Good luck getting those abuelos off their asses. We could use Lamaral's help. You know why Clara never told you about us? Because to her, we're just a bunch of kids playing with guns. She loves to talk about the future. But it's her future, not ours. Clara's just a Castillo who lost his dick. So you have a better plan for Yara? Bullets first, politics later. You said you needed volunteers. Admiral Benitez got the jump on us a couple of hours ago. She's holding my people hostage on a cargo ship. I'll go. Alone? I don't get it. Consider us even for the meds. Save my people, then I'll think about it. Mm-hmm. For real? Libertad? No shit! You saving our people, right? That's the plan. I know a farmer with a helicopter who can fly you out to the ship. Follow me. Take all the rasol. Be nice to him. You're with Libertad? I am. I think it would be great if we joined forces. Yeah? We've been fighting and we've been winning. But Admiral Benitez will always have more than we do. We kill one soldado today. Tomorrow they get replaced with three more. And when La Moral people die, there is no one replacing them. Nadie. On top of that, the farmers and the people just trying to survive don't want to fight. We need fresh blood. Real fighters. What about getting the legends to join? We tried. None of those abuelos want to fight. I heard a lot of them even support Castillo. You heard wrong. Well, I don't see any abuelos fighting now. I'm working on it. So, how do these farmers get a helicopter? They built it from the parts of once we shut down. Ding. These farmers are 100% on our side. The other farmers are not? Some are. What's going on? You're with La Morale, right? Yelena called. Do you want to lift to that boat? Let's do this. Get in. My name's Calixto. Danny. I'm going to be careful and stay low. I'll get you as close as I can. But where did you learn how to fly? I did my basic service as a pilot a couple of years ago. I got kicked out for calling the captain a Kobe mierda. <laughs> I was kicked out of the ground forces. Turns out drill sergeants don't like getting punched in the throat. Good to know. i never seen you before. When did you join La Moral? <laughs> Wait. I was told you were with La Moral. I'm doing this rescue as a favor. I'm with Libertad. What can you tell me about La Moral? You know that village? The 
call it Maldito. That's the real name? Yeah. Some Spaniard named it back in 1490, whatever. Couple months ago, Admiral Benitez decided to make it illegal to go to the water and fish. The people protested. Benitez executed half the town. So what does La Moral do? They tracked and killed every last soldado who did the executing. And I'm not talking about guerrilla ambush jungle shit. I'm talking about following them to their homes and slitting their throats while their families are asleep. Assassin shit. These kids are smart, coordinated, and cold-blooded. Sounds like it. That show pass. We keep tabs on military convoys passing through there and report them to La Moral. Seems like they run a tight operation. These kids are on the ball. Yelena is more organized than the military. La Moral's got our back. When Admiral Benitez started getting rough with our families, La Moral got rough back. Killed any soldado who dared to step foot on our lands. Pretty soon, they stopped coming. That's the ship. I can't get you any closer. This is great. Gracias, mi amigo. Good luck saving those people. Disable the alarm. near the front of the boat. Búscalo. Orden de disparar. 
Thank you, Guerrilla. De nada. I'm on the ship. I freed as many as I could. Hang tight. I am sending boats and backup. Gracias. This is Admiral Benitez. To the fake Yaran terroristas, I have you right where I want you. At this very minute, military forces are heading to your position. I recommend laying down your weapons. Taking one last look at a nation that does not want you. Instead of peacefully serving as outcasts, you will die. Right here. Right now. Yelena. Then waiting for you to clear the air. Can somebody tell those planes to hold still? Watch out!
Yelena, it's done. Your people are safe. I heard. We even for the supplies? Fuck yeah. Need me for anything else? I had to talk to Gilberto first. But you'll be hearing from me. You got my number. You're not so bad, Annie. But you better keep an eye out. If you weren't on Admiral Benitez's radar already, you are now. Welcome to the real Eleste. <laughs> Juan? Who is this? It's Danny, Juan. Who? Danny! Danny! Do you need something? You called me. Not possible in my current state. But I'm glad you reached out. Meet me on Libertad Island immediately. Get? Okay. Why? Juan! <sighs> shit. Coño. I feel like bad shit's gone down here. Clara, I've met La Moral. Why didn't you send me to them first? La Moral? Last I heard, they were a small group always on the edge of falling apart. They're doing more fighting than the legends. Okay, but watch your step. La Moral has a bad rep, and I don't want Libertad's name to be dragged down with him. I'll keep my eyes open. Visits. 
Until one day she told us she had some good news and said she'd be leaving Yara. That was the last time we saw Gabriela. My neighbor thought he saw her at that Biovira place. Tattoos and colorful hair. I'll keep an eye out for her. Gracias. I'm worried something terrible has happened. Engineer's spot.
me sick. Castillo, you fucking monster. I need more pigs. feeling about this place. Light sounds came from in there. Lorenzo. We were just kids, El Tigre. <laughs> <laughs> Lorenzo, I took pictures of that place Horan was talking about. You swipe to the left. They look free to you. Merda. This is what Liberta and La Moral are fighting. You can hate us, but at least we're doing something about it. No one deserves this, Lorenzo. This is happening all over Yara. You just can't see it from so high up this mountain. I can't look at this anymore. I didn't vote for Castillo. The war is over. So that was a waste? That's the end. You shoot the tree. When I was your good, your kindness is the Danny, sun. Come back to Melagu Hero. Shit is getting real. We need to rally our people and talk next steps. Dale.
Hey, Tigre. I think I'm at a dead end with Lucky. I know you want your friends to fight, but there is a lot of young guerrillas in El Este who don't need any convincing. La Moral? They are kids with guns who don't care if they hurt innocent people. They are rough around the edges, but they are dead serious about taking down Castillo, Benitez, and Miquel. Hmm. You're making me think. And when I think, it usually means I should change my mind. So send me. Don't need any convincing. La Moral? They are kids with guns who don't care if they hurt innocent people. They are. around the edges, but they are dead serious about taking down Castillo, Benitez, and Mike. Hmm. You're making me think. And when I think, it usually means I should change I my mind. This okay. I must be doing have something an right. What was that? I don't know You're if I can tell you about kill it. Me? There's a I'm password. A and... I'll find it, baby Tigre. Dios mío, I am... Miguelina? Who are you? I'm a friend of Lorenzo's. Are you one of his children? What? No. Look, I have a letter from him. A letter? Why didn't you just say so? I did. Three times. Lorenzo apologizing? To me? My heart. I can feel it beat again. I'm carried on the wings of butterflies. Cool. I'm just going to, uh, head out. Shh. I'm reading. Guerrilla, can you use power Go tools? buy some shit. Steal some WMD. It's, it's self-care. Can you just sign on? <laughs> Maybe Even I should play again. Danny. I don't know. May the wind protect you on this... What's up, Lorenzo? I got someone to help me send you photographs of the photographs of my children. To your telephone. We did it using this telephone. Got it. Thanks. Technology these days can...
your age when you took a photograph you would have to develop the negative and make a print that would take a week imagine waiting a week to see a photograph today i know gotta go and your telephones i don't know why they are called that they're really hand computers if one person had one of these back in 1967, they could control the world or destroy it. Imagine that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That shit's cray cray. Look. It's about time. Need you to do some dead drops for the cause. You drop off the viviro, I pick up the profits. Who are they drops for? You try these? I took one for research, now I can't stop. Turn my piss purple. You want one? No. Who's paying us for the Viviro one? Before we slit Castillo's throat, we should ask for more flavors. It's the Yankees. Worse. CIA. The fucking CIA is in bed with Libertad? What's Clara think of that? Well, if she knew, I would hope it'd be something like, Thanks, Juan. I'm so happy to have guns to kill fascists named Castillo. Etc., etc. Freedom costs money. Clara doesn't ask. And I'll never tell. It's a private club. Just you, me, and lighthouses filled with Anton's candy. Clara needs to stay shiny for the people. You're protecting her. I'm not so sure I'm the only one looking out for Clara. Just remember, after La Revolución, she won't have time for a guerrilla like you. Just in case. That's the spirit, guerrilla. Mm-hmm, yeah. That shit's cray-cray. Look, I gotta go kill a jaguar. Danny, I bet 50 years from now, you will be able to kill... and the Sinaloa cartel back in 89? If I say yes, I feel like you're still going to tell me. Fucking drug lords want to stash their cash in American real estate so they can launder it. Fifty million dollar deal, Danny. That's great, Juan. I even got them to throw in a few kilos of product. Sold it on the black market, but... lost it all at the tables in Monte Carlo. How is this helping me right now? Nah. I get lonely. Suerte! Lorenzo, I just delivered your letter to Miguelina. You couldn't warn me about all her booby traps? Dios mío, is she hurt? I'm fine, thanks for asking. Miguelina's fine too. She's just trapped in the past, like a lot of you legends. I hope my apology will put her on the path to closure. Now, Danny, please come back. I have another favor that needs favoring. Okay, Lorenzo. El presidente es right.
First package dropped off. Okay, good. Hey, did I tell you about the time I broke the deal for Gorbachev? Let me guess. You made the deal, took a cut for yourself, and lost it in a dumb bet you can't even remember. I mean... Yes? I think this means we are family now. Bienvenido. You thought I would have noticed Libertad selling my viviro to the Yankees? You're a dead man! When the Garillas arrested my family in 67, me, Papa, was dragged to this very cell. I was put in the cell next door. 13. Like you, mijo. We used to talk every single night through this vent. I loved it. His voice taught me to be strong, to be a man. And then the Garillas came. Every day I'm in charge. <laughs> crime by crime, piece by piece he paid to the Garillas. But we would still talk every single night <laughs> until they took his tongue for his lies to Yara. Stop! Papa, stop this! Who is this girl here to you? Ah, I think we should skip a few steps, Raul. Viva Libertad. The attack! The Hotel Paraiso. Danny was there. You... You told me that you hid in the tunnel. Danny could have killed me. Could have given me to Libertad. We have no time for lies. I've stopped running. I've listened. I've learned. I've done everything you have asked. I will be El Presidente. Let Danny go. I am not a monster, Diego. We will give them a chance.
Juan, we're burned. Castillo was waiting. He and his fucking head out tried to kill me. Glad you made it. I, uh... I have to ask. Did you talk, Danny? Not a fucking word. Once a guerrilla, always a guerrilla. The kid, Diego. He saved my life. What? Shaw Danton's headed out dead. Old dog? Binga. This is good. This is very good. We are playing 4D chess in space now, Danny. Fuck your 4D chess, Juan. I just got my molars ripped out. Same thing happened to me back in the Congo. Except I did it to myself. Just chew in the front, like a rabbit. And Juan, let's leave Clara out of it. We got burned. That's all she needs to know. Clara's not enough to fucking deal with, let alone you almost getting torn to pieces. Gracias. Screw the rules. I should check out that cave. Dave is big. Ah, more jellyfish. Let's make a deal, motherfucker. I wonder if La Princesa is up there. This must be La Princesa. Que voila, Your Majesty.
we'll get back in time. Hey, nice work with that rescue. I think I want out of this shit. What's happening? Meeting on the mound. Some of our friends want to quit early. Okay, listen up. This isn't worth killing for. Sure as hell isn't worth dying for. We're young. We should be out there drinking and fucking and skipping school. Woo! Our parents and grandparents already stole our future. Why should we give a shit? That's what I used to think. And then one day, Admiral Benitez walked into my classroom with a gun. She called on your name, you came to the front. One by one. Alvarez, Bermudez, Carrillo. The Admiral read their crimes, protesting, handing out pamphlets, liking a Clara Garcia post. Fernandez, Jimenez, Peña. I learned a lesson on my last day at school. You can either be on the right side of history or the wrong side of Castillo's guns. Wise words, young Guerrilla. Is that morale taking new members? Depends. What? Is there an age limit? I will plead for La Morale. If you take me. Welcome to the war, viejo. <laughs> so how do we take out the Admiral? Push-ups! Are the first step to victory! The Grand Hotel, Danny. That's the key. I got a combo I like to make friends with. No. We need Carlito. Push-ups never lie. Hi. You just cut your... Don't know about you, but I fuck. I like Castillo has many bullets, but we will have. Benitez can't find out where we are, Danny. <coughs> Would you do me a favor? I. That backpack of yours is fabulosa. Welcome to the cause. Hey Danny, you recruit those farmers yet to hit the pass? Remember, say the word boy. Not yet. You think I can't do this on my own?
Danny, I'm your eyes on this one and I'm in position. The dentist is already in there with them. Binga. I thought dentists were always late. Not this one. They've got a medic. Dantes is dead. La morale is safe. For now. <sighs> That's fucking great news, Danny. Oh, and I'm working on a gift for you. Gift? The hotel. I'm taking it. They've tortured their last guerrilla here. You sure you're not La Morale, Danny? I'm just saying. Astronaut! Come here. What do you want the people of Yara to know about the conflict? <laughs> conflict? It's business as usual. Look, in spite of all the rumors going around, there's no war, at least not here in Eastern Yara. Am I right, Admiral? This is not a war. There. The criminals of La Libertad will be stopped. Yeah. They're few, we are many. You hear that? And... Libertards? This means chica. She means business. And what about the violent gang known as La Moral? Anyone who attacks Yara's military or a business interests is not a true Yaran. My strategy... And I helped her with the strategy. I've got decades of experience. I ran a security firm. The East is safe. Am I right? Right. No prea capas, por nada. That's a cut. I gotta go. Señor Presidente. Admiral. So lovely to hear your voice. If I could ask, how is it that a group of school children in El Este are inflicting the highest number of active duty casualties of this war? Admiral? 
they, um, they have support from Libertad and the legends. I've always taken a personal interest in your career. Handpicked you out of the academy. But make no mistake, there were more experienced, more qualified, and more intelligent officers in line before you. You stood out for one simple reason. Si, sí, señor presidente. You were a woman in uniform. And now you could be the highest ranking woman ever to have her head on a pike. Gracias, señor presidente. farmers yet to hit the pass? Remember, say the word knuckleball. Not yet. You think I can't do this on my own? We need people to feel like they're part of this fight. They have the Our RPGs you need that. along with other badass shit. And remember, there's no I in team. But there is an I in win. Cool, cool. I guess everyone in El Este can go to the beach while you're overthrowing Castillo alone. I'm kidding, Honron. I'll think about recruiting your super fans. Gracias. What's up? Shit. What day is today? We always need more wood. We're set for an ambush at the pass. Knuckleballs to go. I've been waiting for this. Time to show Honron what I can do. I've been waiting to use my rocket launcher. RPG is locked and loaded. is never going over. Does the word knuckleball mean anything to you? It sure does. You want us at the pass, right? Si. Sí. I'll meet you there. You're the one who saved our people on that cargo ship, no? That's me. My cousin was one of them. Muchas gracias. De nada. Let's go get this convoy. I'll get my mortar. Mortar time, compay! Still, you have to pay the doctor's bill. And then, where does that freedom go? Out the window! That's what Clara and Libertad want for you. Fake choices and a broken country. They don't love Jara. They only love themselves. Calm. Calm. That's a good horse. Whoa! Ugh. 
You look important. Uh, drop the coconuts. Knuckle ball is a go. Bingo. I thought this day would never come. We need to piece off Benitez and spread out her forces. Music to my ears, guerrilla. See you at the pass. I'll bring the road spikes. Perfecto. We get to use them. Heading your way with the cash. Good job, Danny. Any battle we get will go a long way in this fight. Admiral Benitez has increased patrols now, so watch the roads. Okay. I wonder if that place even has records of Castillo's war crimes. Hey. 
El Tigre, I'm at the museum. So am I. If you want to see photographs of us when we were young and dumb, put your gun away and walk in like it. No backup now.
Lorenzo, you came! What the fuck is he doing here? I wanted him to see Carlito for himself. <laughs> Mi compay. How many years since you've been down the mountain? Too many. Carlito and I, we have a lot of good memories. Time to make some new ones. You should join us, hermano. War is over. When we are all free. See! <laughs> hey, come. Come on, it's gonna be good. No, I'm good. Come on! War is over when we are all free? Since when did you start quoting Lobo? When I finally saw past my own bullshit, and all that remained was the truth. <laughs> Lobo didn't have a way of coming through bullshit. I wish he was here now. He'd be so happy to see us and Carlito. Happy to see you and Carlito, maybe. Enough of that. Sounds like we have her right where we want her. Meet me at El Agujero. I want to go over my attack plan. in the hotel. I've been telling you. We'll make a good command. Hurry up. You have a backup. Thanks. Rendezvous with El Tigre at the place I marked on your map. for you, my baby Tigre. A big battle is on the horizon. I'm just happy everyone is getting along. You did this. Back in 67, it was Santos who could bring the people together. Today, you have that magic. So I'm Santos? No. You are me, the Fist. Now, before every mission, I find that if I imagine myself accomplishing it, I will accomplish it. I just imagine us destroying the Nephi. Are we doing this? You kids today. You're so fast with everything. Take in this moment. The world will change in a couple of hours. Fuck it! 
I'm a little busy right now. I want to do something for opening my eyes to the truth about Castillo and Marites and McKay. We couldn't have this conversation before. Like this way's blocked. I'm gonna go for Benitez. Do it! We'll find another way in and connect with you as soon as we can! A guerrilla has made it inside! Find them! Kill them! No one get away from this one! If you're not dealing with a guerrilla inside, then you're killing guerrillas outside! <laughs>
quedar Isli, Panites. Hey, maybe Tigre. You still be there? See, sí. seems to be fucking death around every corner here. Then make sure you're on the other side of those corners. Claro, El Tigre. You are Tarzan, have nowhere to go! You will- Callate! Get me the fuck out of here! Open my cell! You can do it in the control Let room! Let us out! I will not survive here! Go ahead! Release the fake Yaren rats! They will die! Just like you! I think oh. I wasn't ready for an attack like this! You're not My middle name. Shouldn't it be I'm ready? You've been hanging around and seeing the
anything to help with that! Adiós, Benítez. Ojo por ojo. ¡Viva la moral! Por... ¡Benítez! Couldn't have done this without you, Danny. That's not a smart move. You should cut her down. Why? It's what that bitch deserves. You killed a soldier. Good for you. Except the thing about soldiers is there's always more of them. Sí, mamá. Same mistakes, new faces. You're just bitter because your revolution came and went and all you got was a fucking mountain. <laughs> Enjoy your trophy. Bonitas is private stash. Huh? Salud. Enough with the pics. Victory Danny. I thought I was baby Tigre. Nah. Danny Roja will be bigger than El Tigre. You know why? Because your war will fucking end. Viva la moral! Si! Viva la moral! There's something about third world prisons. They make me hard. As you can see, Mr. McKay, everything is under control. Good old shakedown. I love it. Did they do it? Who the fuck cares? The Admiral was a lamb. She did not have the stomach needed to deal with the terroristas. I would like you to consider expanding your operations. Are you a legend? Open the cell. With respect, El Presidente has a strict... Open it! Did you fight with Santos Espinosa? In the 67 Revolution? 
I drove a tank right through the doors of the Capitolio in the Battle of Speranza. I was there when we took your grandfather. I watched them die. Why did you hate him? The only thing a Castillo has done for Yara is rape our land. And you will do the same thing now. You don't know that. I do! And if you lose in this chains, I will wrap my hands around your little throat and save Yara from another Castillo. Or you can do your country a favor and kill yourself. <laughs> we should have someone look at that mule. It's not mine. <laughs> Not yet. Not yet, but I get the feeling I should be. Hell yes! Okay, it's on, Danny. Have a drink with me at Tucci's. It's a bar west of Concepcion Bay and north of Gran Monte Caballero. You got it, Yelena. The Anciano? Of course. Let's ride. Follow me. Yara is a little more free today. Yar Morale is dead. That is a huge blow to the military. Anton's going to be out for revenge. Watch your back. I always do. Word is, Castillo has a defection problem. You can ride Gosh, shotgun, Daddy. even have a Castillo surrender. I'm not wrong. I calculated my alcohol. I'm good to drive. You sure? I'm fine. So, here's why you're really here. I just got off the phone with Castillo. What? He said, if I turn you in, he will release all of the outcasts in El Este. You're joking, right? It's for the greater good, Danny. What? Aren't you ready to sacrifice yourself for the good of Yara? Coño. You're fucking with me. Of course I am. Shit. Lighten up, Danny. Besides, I give up Lorenzo first. <laughs> Where are we going? First to Old Ron, then our island. With Benita instead, it's safe to go back there. You have an island? It was our place to hang out, hook up, drink. I'd go there to study. Hell of a mix. <laughs> Honron and her brother showed it to me. Honron has a brother? Yeah. He and I... We had a thing. No shit. Where is he? I need another drink for that story. We're here. Uh, okay. Word is, Castillo has a defection problem. Mm -hmm. We might even have a Castillo surrender. You're dreaming, man. Fuck yeah, I am. Hey! Let's get this party started!
your nose. I was studying while you were playing games. Hey, it's trying that counts. <laughs> what are you, the fucking UN? Let's get Danny a trophy for trying. What's next? Is this gonna be party, Jelena, or wiki, Jelena? Fuck off. You getting the grill? You know how I feel about using that thing. Animals have goddamn brains, too. You know dolphins can use tools? Cojone, there was a beautiful second I forgot you were vegan. Can you show Danny where the grill is? Yeah, yeah, you monsters. Danny, grab that. I'll show you where to find meat or fish to cook. Or plant-based food for the good of your soul. Where did Danny go? I'll show you where the grill is. Walk with me. <clears throat> I'm getting drunk tonight, that's for fucking sure. I hope Anna shows up. <coughs> hmm, no mosquito. That's weird. You know, Yelena likes you. We all like you. You should be joining La Moral. I'm going to leave her down. You might think she's all talk, but Clara Garcia, she picked me up when I had nothing. Nobody. Wouldn't be here if it wasn't for her. <laughs> that reminds me of this fucking grill. What? It was the early days of La Moral. We were starving after a beautiful day of fighting. We killed a hundred soldados and... Every day you guys kill a hundred soldados. <laughs> Whatever. Yo, the point is, we came here to celebrate. Everybody's throwing meat on the grill, and I asked them to make room for my veggies. And everyone starts making fun of my veganness. I'm a fun drunk, okay? But if I hear, eat some fucking arroz con puerco con ron one too many times, I kind of lose my shit, just a bit. I will remember that for later. <laughs> well, you've been warned. So, I'm pissed. My big brother, Gerardo, sees people picking on me, and he fucking snaps. Grabs the grill with his bare hands. Hot as shit, meat still cooking, and chucks it into the ocean. Everybody was gonna kill me. Gerardo steps up, the way a good big brother does. <laughs> he always had my back when no one else did. He died, like, a week after that. Fucking miss him. I'm sorry, Oron. But I'm sure he's happy we took down Benitez. <laughs> Gerardo wishes he was at this party, for sure. He'd always say, we're not here to feel like shit. We're here to erase the past and drink to our future. And to eat our veggies, right? <laughs> exactly, Danny. The grill's over there. Watch out for the sharks. Follow me. This place feels smaller than I remembered. Come, 
I'll show you where to find some good something up. Do I look like a soldier to you? Come. I'll show you where to find some good hunting. You just need to point me in the right direction. <sighs> this island reminds me so much of Gerardo. Oh. Honron's brother? Yeah. What happened to him? In the early days of La Moral, Honron and Gerardo were so reckless. The two of them did this stupid smash and grab on a checkpoint and got arrested. I tried to bribe the guards to free them, but they could only get one out. I had to choose. My heart said Picarardo, but Honron is the best guerrilla we have. You picked Honron over your boyfriend? I did. I had a plan for the next day. We were going to break him out, but Benitez executed all the prisoners as punishment for Honron being freed. She doesn't know. Gerardo was thrown up at the fort. Bing. I think about that choice every day. And the truth is, I had to do it over again. I'd still pick Honron. It's the right call. It's just... Well, you know. There's only one person responsible for Gerardo's death. And that's Castillo. Gracias, Danny. But I was born with an eye for bullshit. In La Revolución, we are all guilty. Just some a bit more than others. I think Libertad might have a bit more faith in humanity. And that's why I'll never join. Look, there's crocodiles and... Something up? So, look, there's crocodiles and fish on the side of the island. And grab a couple of carrots for our fucking rabbit, Honron. You got it, Yelena. I'm just going to take a minute alone. It's been a long time since I've been here. Good boy. Don't kill me. Thing on this island shouldn't be too hard. Uh-oh. 
I know you're there, little fishy. They're not going to rope me into doing an unpaid dance. <laughs> oh no, thank you. Feels good to be above ground. Better get this food on the grill. <laughs> Hola. Playtime's over, Danny. Oh, shit. You all just left me? You're the one who kicked us off our island. Um, I do not remember that. That's the least of our problems. I got some sheep news. Our base was compromised last night. <sighs> Repinga. How fucked are we? Gilberto's chameleons got word ahead of time. They were able to clean everything out before the soldados raided the place. Don't go back there. Where are you setting up shop? Thanks to you, at the Grand Hotel Caballero. Swing by soon. McKay and Castillo are already fortifying their poison production operations in La Jolla. You got it. Hey, hola. The Admiral has died. God rest her soul. All right. Thank God. Huh. It's over.
Oye, el tigre. A mí no me gusta el tigre. Depends. What an announcement. McKay Industries invests 100 million into El Presidente's vision. So we hit McKay. He's the money behind Castillo. No. First we kill Castillo, then McKay won't matter. Yeah, what the fuck do we care about a Yankee in a suit? It's the money. No money, no tanks, no bullets, no soldiers. I got it. Yolena, Honron, Lorenzo, me, and all of La Moral will go after Castillo. Danny, you kill McKay. That doesn't make sense. Oh, I was getting tired of talking. Goodbye! Here he is! Batter up! <laughs> Watch my... Get back! Blaze, incoming! Cojones!
Elena, what's wrong? That was Gilberto. The attack. It wasn't to kick the fort. It was to keep us inside. Bad time for an I told you so. I 
I came to say goodbye to an old friend. Back in 67, we didn't mourn our dead. Death was glorious. We were stupid. Castillo and McKay crossed the line today. More will die and nobody is safe. Not an old legend. Or a new one. Or the leader of El Este. Or the fist of the revolution. We have to stop Castillo and that Yankee. We? You kids look like you could use a little luck. I don't want to hear a word about I uploaded a pic of the jammers. Hola, Jonis Gilberto. Hey. I'm still in shock. El tigre and Honron in one day? Pinga. I'm going to kill Castillo and McKay. Ojo por ojo. Exactly. Now, I didn't call to check on your revenge meter. It's pretty fucking high. I'm sure it is, Honey. I wanted you to know that I'm set up at La Moral's new HQ at Cardoso Mill. Come say hello when you can. You got it, Gilberto. Oh, and another thing, since we don't need a doorman anymore, Alfredo is looking for some adventure. You think Libertad could use him? Sure thing. Send him to Benito. He could always use the help. I bet McKay's building will be swarming with soldados. See, sí. so I highly recommend taking out more jammers or gearing up for a fight. Gracias, mi socio. No hay problema. Mierda. Grabbing a ride. case building. The place is filled with Castillo loyalists. How you handle those people is up to you. You might be able to do this and not be noticed. Hey, sometimes it's good to be noticed. Gilberto says part of the building is being renovated, so if you see construction, chances are there'll be less people. Thanks for the tip.
Huh. <laughs> 